on to the bicep exercises. Now there's a couple of different ways to do it. So I'm just going to start out with the wide grip. Every time you do the bicep on a wide grip, you're actually working the inner side of the bicep. When you go close grip, you're going to work the out, outer part. Good. Notice how he's not dropping the weight real fast. It's coming nice and slow down. It's a very controlled movement. Now if some people arch their back, they swing it up. And that's what you don't want to do. That's exactly what you don't want to do. You know, so he's doing it properly. He's lifting the weight controllably. Perfect. He's going to switch now to the close grip for his outer, outer bicep. It's very, very important for you to do the two head of the biceps. Remember, biceps means two. So you have the inner head and the outer head. And for you to get a complete development of the bicep muscle, you have to do both. Awesome. An exercise called hammer curls. Now hammer curls, you grip, grip it just like Travis has it. It's 45 degrees, and you bring it up, and you work the brachioradialis muscle, and that's the only muscle that's going to actually process the joint for the complete development. That's the proper form of doing it. Everything's lined up right at 90 degrees. Everything, he's not moving his elbow. His arm is just the whole time. His arm is moving. Elbow stay, stay stationary. And you also have a choice of doing them both at the same time if you want if you wanted to. Just like this. Perfect. 